So this is my next recipe. This is my beautiful Cajun chicken with a lovely lemon rice. You will absolutely love it. So I've got these beautiful Bally Manor chicken fillets. And look at them, aren't they absolutely beautiful? Nice size, beautiful portion. And to this, I'm going to make a simple Cajun spice. And what we do is take a garlic clove and we crush it. You know I like to slice my garlic, but in this one we're going to crush it. And the best way to crush any garlic, I'm not a fan of them garlic pressers. I think it makes the garlic go bitter. What I do is I just press it like so, add a pinch of salt, and just give it a good mix. So to this, I'm going to take some beautiful thyme, like so. And when it's so fresh like this and it's not woody, don't, work, don't bother you know, taking it off the stems, just chop it. So, like so, mix it all together. So what we're going to do basically now is we're going to put half of it onto each chicken. And what I've done is there, just to get extra flavour in it, I've just scored it with a knife. Okay. To this now I'm going to add some beautiful cayenne pepper. And you can add as much or as little as you want. And I've got all these beautiful ingredients in the needle. So lovely sweet paprika. Give it a good rub. Do it both sides. And a wee tip, if you can marinate it for a couple of hours if you want, overnight would be brilliant. Smell that straight away, absolutely brilliant. So a nice bit of cayenne pepper. Get some lovely oil in there. And give that a good rub. Nice bit of salt. And get, get your hands in there. Get a bit of rubbing going. Get right into that lovely scorn. You got all that lovely paste of your garlic and your thyme. Look at that. We're just going to place it into a nice grill pan, like so. This would be great on the barbecue. So, oh, you want to smell that straight away. So a little tip is when I grill meats, for example, chicken or I'm grilling pork or, or beef, always oil the actual meat. So there's no oil in that pan. So while that's cooking, here I've just got cooked some lovely rice and the best way to cook rice is just basically in the pan covered just with cold water bring it to the boil add a pinch of salt and cook it for about 10 minutes and you strain it and every time you get beautiful rice and you can see there it looks nice it's just boiled rice but we're going to take it to the next level we're going to add some beautiful zests of lemon And basically I've got some beautiful cashew nuts. You can use whatever you want. You could use peanuts, almonds. The best way to toast, toast your nuts, do not burn them guys, do not burn them. Do not burn your nuts. It's in a dry pan and just toast them, like so. So I've got a lovely bit of lemon. Lemon juice in here. I'm dying to turn this chicken, but it's not ready. Don't be a pan shaker, leave it alone, let it cook. You can see it's nicely colouring up the sides. I'm dying to turn it, but it's not ready. I'm just going to add some beautiful, thinly sliced spring onion. So straight in there, lovely rice. And some beautiful mint. Nicely thinly sliced. I'm going to add a little bit of oil. My nuts, I nearly did burn my nuts actually. I forgot about them. So in the there. Look at that rice, absolutely brilliant. And you can serve this instead of chicken, you can serve this on its own. So let's give the rice a good mix. Can't wait to turn this lovely chicken. Look at that. Doesn't that look absolutely brilliant? Absolutely, look at that. Beautiful, you can see the lovely garlic and the thyme's kind of roasted together. Absolutely beautiful. So we're going to cook this now for another four or five minutes. You could do this in the barbecue, you could put the whole lot in the oven if you want, but we're just going to grill it. Grill it. What I like to do is I just like to finish the Cajun chicken with some lovely bit more spice. And I've got all the ingredients in Lidl, and this is a great brand, this is their lovely spices that you Paprika, chili, cans, absolutely brilliant. The beautiful Bally Manor chicken. Doesn't that look absolutely great? Look at that. So in the recipe, the little tip is, I just took some beautiful yogurt and I've mixed it through some lovely mint. So I'll finish this off with olive oil. So that is my beautiful Bally Manor chicken, cooked Cajun style. 
with lovely lemon rice and mint yogurt.